Ignition, full thrust. Five good SRBs. Alice is clear the tower. Start our pitch over maneuver. Entering our first throttle bucket. We've ended our pitch over maneuver. Body rates turn to zero. One point five miles in altitude, traveling twelve hundred miles per hour. Mach one, Alice is now supersonic. Throttling back up to near full power. Two miles down range. Six miles in altitude. Hydraulics continue to look good. Body rate is expected. Alice continues right down the center of the range track. Six miles down range. Entering our next throttle bucket, preparation for SRB burnout. At this point in flight, Alice is now half of its original liftoff weight, and engines continue to look good. And max Q, maximum dynamic pressure. And good indication of SRB burnout. Engine response continues to look good. Preparing for SRB jettison. Vehicle throttling back up to full power, and we got a good indication of separation of all five SRBs. Hydraulics continue to look good. Body rates looking as expected. Vehicles now approaching 40 miles downrange, 37 miles in altitude. We've been able to close loop steering. And two minutes to expected VECO. Engine continues to look healthy. Vehicle is now 72 miles downrange, traveling at 5,500 miles per hour. Entering our next throttle segment. Maintaining a constant 2.5 Gs in preparation for PLF jettison. And we've got activation of the RCS system on the upper stage. Vehicles past the Carmen line, we've exited the Earth's atmosphere. Approaching 7,000 miles an hour, 120 miles downrange. And we've got payload fairing jettison, and good indication of CFLR deck jettison. Engine continues to burn nominally. Sixty seconds to nominal Beco. Hydraulics to look good. Engine will begin throttling down to maintain constant acceleration for the remainder of boost phase. Body rates continue to look good. Engine continues to operate as expected. Approaching 10,000 miles an hour, 230 miles downrange. 30 seconds to expect to go. We've got activation of boost phase chill down. And completion of boost phase chill down. Engine housing temps responding as expected. And Beco booster engine cutoff. Good indication of centaur separation. Got pre start on H2 and O2. And ignition of centaur upstage. This will be a 13 minute, 36 second first burn. We've enabled steering on the upper stage. Center PU set to open loop. 